Okay. First of all, let's look at the components of this IKEA cube shelf. First of all, I got this um, this barn door kit rail, and that's quite uh, easy. You just get the kit and you adapt it. It was already one and a half meters long, so I didn't have to do much. Um, I had to use some different bolts uh, to the ones that came in the kit, and that's fine. You'll find that when you do hacks and you buy kits, they're not always going to be the right size. So I've done that. The other component is MDF. I've gotten some MDF. I've painted it, I've sealed it, and then on top I've put some black flat paint on it. Then I've gotten some fence palings and I sanded them down and I treated them and I sealed them, got it to the right size, and then with some liquid nails, I actually glued it all around. Now it seems like a really easy, simplified version of how this went, but it's actually quite laborious. Um, but it is really fun to do and it's super cheap. Um, the kit was about $100 and all these little things, you know, face palings, they're like $2 each. Um, this was a hand-me-down. So as you can see, for just over $100, I managed to make a piece of redundant furniture actually useful. I love, I love the feel. It's just given this whole little mountain Nordic look to it. And over here, I've done the same thing with the other piece of the IKEA cube shelf, where I've actually put it downwards. Um, usual easy hacks, um, wood palings of fence, sanded them down. If you want to give it a white wash, it even looks nicer. Seal it, and then it's all done. It gives that nice cabin look. And I've actually done the same thing here with the table. This was an old IKEA table that had been outside. Um, you know, the paint was all coming off. So I decided to paint it black, flat, just like the chalkboard. And the same thing on top, just cut a few pieces of wood, sand it down, give it a white wash. And, um, and this really cost me like probably $5. So as you can see, if you're on a budget and you really want to save the planet, just trying to use as much as you can, give it a different touch and, um, and you've done something great for the environment.